Good morning, everyone. Today is October 20th, and it's Thursday. My accident was Tuesday, October 11th. I want to read the word to you this morning. Vindicate me, my God, and plead my cause against an unfaithful nation. Rescue me from those who are deceitful and wicked. You are God my stronghold. Why have you rejected me? Why must I go about mourning, oppressed by the enemy? Send me your light and your faithful care. Let them lead me. Let them bring me to your holy mountain, to the place where you dwell. Then I will go to the altar of God, to God my joy and my delight. I will praise you with the leer, O God, my God. Why, my soul, are you downcast? Why so disturbed within me? Put your hope in God. For I will yet praise Him, my Savior and my God. As I was reading this this morning, I was struck by verse 3. Send me your light and your faithful care. Let them lead me. Let them bring me to your holy mountain, to the place where you dwell. Friends, Hebrews 1.7 says that God makes his angels spirits. Verse 3 says, Send me your light, the spirit of light, and your faithful care the spirit of care and let them light the way leading me carefully to the holy mountain of God my vehicle is totaled my credit is still totaled even though it's been seven years evil hates me and targets me. My friend, whom I had just spent time with on October 10th, wound up also being in a terrible accident October 11th. He is out of the hospital and home. He is suffering with pain. Please keep him and me in your prayers. This is not the end, friends. This is just the entrance into a dark place where the Lord God will lead by sending his angel of light and care to take us through this dark valley so that we can be with God on his holy mountain. Let no trial beguile you 
remember who you are in every trial even in trials when it seems there is no hope and pain constantly tries to swallow you up hold firm friends god bless you